I'm gonna go to try on some suits for the final table. Do you wanna come? Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> awesome, all right. Uh, I'll see you there in like an hour, is that cool? Sounds good. I'm wearing a custom suit shop. I'm here to pick out my suit for the final table. Ricky, how's it going? Hey, good Max. to see you. Welcome yeah. back. Yeah. Hey, good to see you. I started dressing nicely when I made my first final table. Got like a nice shirt, I got a tie, and it's evolved into the point where now I'm wearing suits. I just feel empowered in a suit playing poker. It makes me feel confident. Let's go design yeah. some custom suits. Let's do it. So we are a lifestyle destination shop. We are a gentleman's haberdashery. If you haven't experienced the custom process, it's just something that every guy needs to experience once. A lot of the guys who are dressed up pretty well are often recreational players. So it might actually just give you an edge because people play incorrectly against you. Are you gonna wear a bow tie? Or? Going for the Bill Nye look for the final table. I don't think the other players care that I'm wearing a suit. I'm not worried about what they're feeling or thinking. I'm just thinking about myself. In men's fashion, you have to accessorize. You can't leave the house without your pocket square. Lapel pins, time keys, bracelets. You can't over accessorize. So why don't we try a few things on? Our black label dinner jacket looks phenomenal on you. Too flashy. No, I think it's flashy done well. Yeah. But like I said, you can't not have a lapel accessory. I like it a lot. Suit number two. Suit number two is looking good. The pink pinstripe and then all the pink accoutrement. Um, I think you look phenomenal. I, I love this suit. This yeah. one's pretty much perfect. This look is brilliant. Solid. To you, Max, we wish you the best of luck. Get out of here.